Hello students, this is Pawan Jaiswal. Today we are going to see a question from progressions. This question was asked in Elipmus twice. Here he said, a basketball is dropped from a height of 100 feet and it bounces back each time one half of the last bounce. If this is the case, approximately how far the ball has to travel before it comes to rest. Option A 350 feet, Option B 250 feet and Option C 240 feet and the last option is 300 feet. Now let's try to see the solution here. A ball is dropped from a height of 100 feet. Again it bounces back to half means 50 feet. Now as you all know that this ball comes down once again back 50 feet. Again it bounces back to half that is 25 feet. Again it has to come down 25 feet. Again it has to go up 12.5. Again it has to come down 12.5 and so on till it comes to here we see a pattern 50, 50, 25, 25, 12.5, 12.5 and so on. Excluding this 100, if we take the numbers 50 plus 50 plus 25 plus 25 plus 25 by 2 plus 25 by 2 and so on to infinity. Let us try to see the sum of these numbers. We can say this is 2 times of 50 plus 25 plus 25 by 2 plus 25 by 4 and so on to infinity. Now the inside one is looking in the form of GP that is geometric progressions. We have the sum of infinity formula that is a by 1 minus r. Here the a value is 50, the first term 1 minus r and the r value is the ratio. Second term divided by the first term that is half, that is 50 by half which makes 100. Using this we have to understand that the one which is inside bracket stands for 100 which means 200 feet it has gone. So the value of this thing is 200 and now let's try to add the 100 from where the ball has dropped in the beginning. So it results to 300 feet. So from the options if we see Delhi is the correct answer. Thank you.